The Supreme Court on Friday granted bail to Delhi Chief Minister Arvind Kejriwal after it observed that his prolonged incarceration amounts to unjust deprivation of liberty. After his arrest by the Central Bureau of Investigation in June in connection with the alleged liquor excise policy case, the Aam Aadmi Party leader can now leave jail after nearly six months, that too, without a trial, since he already has bail in the case filed by the Enforcement Directorate. While granting bail to Gejri Wall, the Supreme Court listed some conditions for the Chief Minister to follow, including those set when he got relief in the ED case. These include release subject to a bail bond of Rs 10 lakh, Kejriwal cannot make comments about the Delhi liquor policy case. The Delhi chief minister will have to be present for trial unless exempted by courts. Kejriwal can't enter the chief minister's office or the Delhi secretariat while out on bail. He cannot sign official files. Kejriwal's release will be a huge relief for him and the Aam Aadmi Party ahead of the Haryana elections. The AAP chief will now be released from jail six months after his arrest by the Enforcement Directorate on March 21st. He was subsequently arrested by the CBI in June. Here are some of the Supreme Court's key quotes. Perception also matters and CBI must dispel the notion of being a caged parrot and must show it is an uncaged parrot. CBI should be like Caesar's wife above suspicion. No impediment in arresting person already in custody. We have noted that CBI in their application recorded reasons as to why they deemed necessary. There is no violation of Section 41A3 of Code of Criminal Procedure, said Justice Surya Kant. Justice Ujjal Bhuyan, however, noted, CBI did not feel the need to arrest him even though he was interrogated in March 2023 and it was only after his ED arrest was stayed that uh, CBI became active and sought custody of Mr. Kejriwal and thus felt no need of arrest for over 22 months. Such action by the CBI raised a serious question on the timing of the arrest and such an arrest by CBI was only to frustrate the bail granted in ED case. Submission of additional solicitor general cannot be accepted that appellant has to first approach trial court for grant of bail. Process of trial should not end up becoming a punishment. Belated arrest by CBI is not justified. And as it had for Mr. Sisodia, the court said it was a travesty of justice to keep Mr. Kejriwal in jail without notice of a trial, particularly since he had already been granted bail in the case filed by the ED, in which he faced charges under the Stringent Prevention of Money Laundering Act. News Desk, Global.